Azir Mohammed, welcome to our program. Uh, Thank you. Hala Kuwait. Maybe you could tell us about some of the uh, future events, plans, and so forth. Well, we have many uh, future events and competitions as well held. Uh, some of which, like the shooting competition, we have uh, each year, mm -hmm. uh, as well as the photography competition. Uh, we'll also be holding a, a beach cleanup day. Uh, we'll also be visiting the elderly and the orphanages. So we'll kind of touch up. Yeah, on you're all. varied, huh? Yeah. Do events for the engineer society and exactly. families, community service. So it's really exactly. nice to see that. Exactly, and we also uh, I'd like to bring up that we'll we'll have. Uh, something called uh, Duaniyat al Muhandisin. What is that we, about? Uh, we bring influencers, uh, we bring, uh, bring uh, uh, some... Uh, uh, well-known uh, people, yeah? yeah officials and uh, well-known people, and uh, uh, we touch up on topics, uh, either recent topics or past topics. Uh, and it's not just necessarily on engineering topics. It's open. Open, yeah. An open discussion like for the community. style. Yeah, for the community. Great, that's really yeah. great to hear so many... Engineer Muhammad, tell us... Um, I know there's the Kuwait Engineers Day. Yes. That's a big event that you have yes. every year. So tell our audience a little bit about that, please. Sure. Uh, actually, this uh, Kuwait Engineer Day is the first time held in Kuwait. Uh -huh. um, it was a proposal uh, like done two years ago okay. by Kuwait Site, Site uh -huh. Engineers uh, to the World Federation of, uh, of Organizations, Engineering Organizations, mm -hmm. which is part of UNESCO. Um, and uh, basically, uh, they got uh, the approval. They gave us the approval, Great. and uh, they dedicated seventh of March of every year to be Kuwaiti uh, Engineer Day. And this is the first year we, we're celebrating it, and uh, first time in the state of Kuwait. And we're honored to to be the host. Good to hear that. And who's yes. going to be sponsoring or helping out with this big event festival? Yeah, well, uh, we have uh, Amiri Diwan. They're uh, fully uh, hosting the... Means it'll the, be a successful event. Exa exactly. The event will be hosted in Sheikh uh, Jabal Al Ahmed uh, Cultural Center, uh -huh. the new one. Also a beautiful venue. Exactly, yeah. And um, there will also be sponsors for the celebration throughout. Mm -hmm. uh, we also have along uh, um, another sponsor, KFAS, uh, Kuwait Foundation for... Uh, the Advancement of Sciences, yeah. Exactly. Um, we, we will also have in presence uh, of uh, the Minister uh, Engineer Hussam al Rumi, uh, His Excellency. And um, uh, despite uh, us contact him in short notice, he was more he's than willing. He's eager and willing. Yeah, he's more than willing to, uh, to participate. Great. Well, we look forward to this uh, big event. And uh, Engineer Mohammed, any uh, coming towards the end of our interview, any last words or comments for the audience watching Hala Kuwait tonight? Well, of course, I'd like to thank uh, Kuwait Sarti of Engineers as a whole and uh, in specific uh, the chairman, the board members and the volunteers for all their effortless uh, time put, it, put into, uh, into this event and uh, to, to making this happen to our sponsor, Diwan, uh, Amiri Diwan and uh, KFAS, as well as to His Excellency uh, uh, the Minister. Hassan uh, Rumi and uh, of course to Kuwait TV for hosting us tonight and uh, for allowing us to share our. Uh, uh, well, it's a pleasure always to have uh, members of the Kuwait uh, Society of Engineers on our program, and uh, we wish you all the best of luck in this event.